Hi there. Before starting this video, big shout out to those who had subscribed to me. Thank you guys for subscribing. And I do hope you would like my future videos, including this one. Also, big shout out to Deadly Fury 16, who became my partner. So I advise you guys to check out his videos and his channel because he really has some cool tutorials here that you would well, find interesting and helpful. So that's that the Fury 16. Geeky Artist's first partner. So on with the vid. So I'm actually going to talk about VB Script. So VB Script is uh, short for Visual Basic Scripting. It is a handy tool for file, drive, and registry maintenance in Windows, basically. So we have here some cool tools you can download, like uh, character code generator, um, changing paths for setup files, drive letters. This change recycled bin name, I had tried this, but unfortunately it didn't work for me, so I don't know what I did wrong. It could have been that this is for older versions of Windows, so I'm not really sure, but anyway, it might work for you, so just try it. So, uh, create folder context menu item, delete temporary files, extract files, get IP address. This one I downloaded. It's, well, pretty simple, so it just displays my IP ad. And other tools here that are VBS files. So if, if you guys can't open VBL, VBS files or y you can actually view them, uh, you can download the latest version of the Windows script. I'm actually using 5.7 so just update your Windows script to be able to view or create such files. So. I'm here to uh, give credit again to Mr. CompTelp for ha um, uploading this cool video about pop-up boxes which inspired me to do a similar video. Well, I have here a sample of a pop-up box that I learned from him so this is trick and as you can see I've already changed the icon instead of the normal VBS um, icon with the if if you had noticed it's it's a script file so it has the icon of a script so instead of that I just change it to this help icon so th this is called trick this is called prank and I have a text um, file here that I use to create um, both uh, VBS files so on with trick so I actually add a sound here. So anyway, um, I actually used a different combination. I'm going to show you that later, but <laughs> so I'm sorry. I'm I'm going through this with you guys. <laughs> anyway, so there you go. I, I just finished that trick. So I, I'll put this in the description. This is the VB script message box function and these are the numbers here so one is for ok uh, two is cancel, three abort or try, ignore and these are also the other numbers that you can use as you create your uh, message boxes so I'm going to show you how I did mine this is pranked so there you go, this is the um, command line. I'm just going to. Here we go. So x is space, equal sign, message box, then parentheses, um, quotation mark. So this is your message. And this is the number combinations that I had showed you earlier. So these are the numbers that you can combine. So if you want a, a abort, retry, ignore, 
soft buttons or you want an exclamation or a warning message icon and all that you could actually um, change it by imp by well putting the number here plus the sign so if you would recall a while ago I just had the OK button there this time I have 3 plus 17 here so this will just show a yes or no button if I'm not mistaken and um, a big X and again it changes it actually changes the sound when you open it so let's just get on with this So it's just as easy as that. So to be able to save this as a BBS file, all you have to do is click all files, then prank2.bbs. Save. There you go. This is my prank2. And uh, what if you just want to save it, uh, or you would just want to change the um, extension name directly from your desktop or your folder or anything like that. Just go to control panel. Uh -huh. Sorry about that. And um, uh -huh. uh, performance and maintenance, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, sorry, I'm wrong. It's appearance and themes. Sorry for that. Folder options. Uh -huh. View. Then you just tick the. Uh, sh oh, where are you? Hide extension for known file name. So just uncheck that. Apply. Okay. So you can see that you already have. You, you are already seeing the extension name of your file so this one is dot text so just rename it instead of text type vds enter so if you uh, became stable uh, or unusable I'm sorry so are you sure you want to yes oh sorry it's already uh, existing so I'm just going to delete this yes so again VBS, blah blah blah. Yes, and there you go. So it's an easier way to change your text files to VBS, or just save it directly as VBS. Anyway, it's it's just um, more easier if you're editing or it, or if you want to edit it, then just you know return it to dot text. Yes, and you could edit it if you want. So anyway. So those are the things that I just wanted to share. Again, big thanks to Comp Help for the easy tutorial on how to pop pop boxes. And um, thank you guys, most well, most of you who had subscribed to me. And um, again, please check out uh, Deadly Fury 16's channel and vids. So there you go. And thanks for watching my video.